Good morning, good afternoon, and good night, everybody. It is day two on the Disney Dream, and we are at Marvel Day at Sea. This is basically a themed day where you see a bunch of Marvel characters around the ship. They have themed events around the Marvel. They're playing Disney Marvel movies, and they have Disney Marvel events at nighttime. They're playing like dramatic Marvel esque music right now. I feel like I'm in an intro to a movie. It seems like in the D-Lounge you can meet different Marvel characters. Oh wow, <laughs> look, it's Iron Man. I've never seen him outside of Avengers Campus before. That's awesome. And then to the right, we got Spider-Man chilling. This is so cool, what? I love this for the families. Now just keep in mind for yourself when you're booking your Marvel Day at Sea that that meet and greet, Spider-Man and Iron Man, is actually a reservation-based event. It's free, but it does book up. We have an event called Cosmic Academy going on right now. Basically, you can learn how to draw different Marvel characters. Oh my gosh, I thought this was Captain America. We're always making new friends. Yes, sir, what's your name? Michael. And? Guys, I love the outfit. I love the effort you put into it. You're, you're, you're blowing me. You're putting me to shame. Fair enough. <laughs> Spider-Man in the Evolution Lounge. This is the place we were at last night partying. Now you can meet Captain America in here. Always making new friends. What's your name? Katie from North Carolina. I love your shirt. Thank you. And then your ears. Come on. Yeah, great. One thing that you need to know about these character lines is that you can get in line starting 15 minutes prior. So. Captain America is meeting at 12, 11.45 is when you should show up because the line gets really long and they do cut it off. Personally, I can't go in line right now, but that's okay because characters will be around throughout the day. And honestly, I just want to see everything. Like, I hate standing in one place for too long. They literally do events everywhere. They have Marvel trivia at 12.30 and 3 o'clock. That's fun. Doctor Strange. Yes, sir. Very nice to see you. <laughs> Good to see you. Well, of course it is, isn't it? How are you doing? Quite well. How about yourself? Chilling. I just started my uh, journey today. I was just looking for heroes and heroes. Yeah, and you're a hero. I would like to think so. Doctor, who have you all seen so far? Um, I saw Captain America and just you. And just me. Yeah, I woke up a little late today. What's so. alright? Sounds like you've met the two best so far. <laughs> yeah, honestly. All downhill from here, yes. Fa yeah, honestly. Quite fair. literally, we are walking oh, down a bit wow. of hill. That, that, yeah, that makes sense. Gosh, so cool to see you, man. Of course it is. Can we get a portrait real quick? I'd be more than happy to. Awesome. Make sure you're getting my good side. Yeah, I got it. Then again, I, they all are. Yeah. There you go. Hands like this. Hands like this. Bring your ring fingers into your thumbs. Ring fingers into... Oh, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah there you go. Little pinkies. Pinkies, oh my gosh. Connect those together. Connect this together. Bring the middle fingers together as well. Please. Just bring the core fingers up. Oh my gosh. This is not... This is so hard. <laughs> so it took me oh, years of okay, 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 okay. I'm getting it. There you are. Wow. This is very nice. Let's see. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I was afraid I was about to break my fingers. He really is a magician. Sorcerer Supreme. Sorcerer Supreme. Wong, yeah. Wong's pretty cool too. Hopefully we can see him. Right. Sometimes. He is always Wong and never right. Wong and that's... It's not strange, everybody. Cool. Well, you have a good day. <laughs> Oh man, my day's already made. And that's what I mean, it's like you could wait in line, but also just walking around, you never know who you're gonna run into. Like, that was not planned. Like, he's still just chilling. And they're just playing the Avengers music on blast. I love this. It is so strange, but cool, that they're playing Agatha Harkness's anthem from the Disney Plus show, WandaVision. <laughs> Well, this is fun. I am Okoye Jera from Jordan Alonso. Thank you on special assignment from the Black Panther to pass away today all of you. I really like this. It's basically getting kids involved, teaching them how to fight. It's very similar to the show that they do at Avengers Campus. Yeah! <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Even though it's lunchtime, welcome to Marvel Day at Sea. How do you feel? I feel 
like an Avenger. I'm ready to conquer the world right now. Not I, conquer, but save. Oh, okay. That's more like a Thanos. Yeah, bro. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of odd. Sorry. I should have brought the Infinity Gauntlet, but. Oh, <laughs> we should have brought our Lego Avengers Tower. Totally. <laughs> that would have <laughs> that would have worked out perfectly. We should have rebuilt it on the yeah. cruise ship. It's Miss Marvel. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Wait, that's so cool. I've never seen him. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's Spider-Man. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Having fun? Wow, look at that pose. We gotta do some uh, stretching. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Jeet, what are you doing? Are you betraying me? Oh, hey friend. <laughs> um, no elevator. Up the stairs we go. <sighs> Something I'm realizing is that because it's a Marvel day at sea, everyone on the ship loves Marvel to a certain degree. So that guy just randomly hopping in the camera. Like, it's fun energy here. It's really cool. This is the first real day on the cruise. Everyone has time to sleep. And Man, you sound out of breath. Are you okay? I'm actually out of breath right now. <laughs> Going up all these stairs and talking and holding my heavy camera. It could be a lot. And I haven't eaten. So we really need to go eat. Gosh, why'd you call me out? <laughs> now this is why I wear flip-flops coming outside. The sun is out. People are outside. Oh my gosh. I think they're playing uh, Miss Marvel right now. Yeah, they are. And you can see the stage is set up for tonight, which I'm excited to see. We are getting lunch at Cabanas from 12 to 2.30. Keeping up with the theming, they have a post of She-Hulk in here. I am so hungry. With this place just opening, it's very busy right now. Kind of hard to find a seat, but shout out Jeet for finding the perfect seats by the water. Also, they're playing Avengers music right now as well. Starting off with the kids section, fries, mac and cheese, pork steaks, carrots, green beans, chicken with apples and ham, pepperoni pizza, margarita pizza, meatloaf, chicken corn dog, plain pasta, bread service, red snapper, shrimp, salads. But what I'm here for, which I did not know they did, which I'm so excited about, they have freaking crab like I love crab it's my absolute favorite I'm gonna eat so much like this is so expensive in Disney World you can get two of these for like 25 bucks towards the front they do have coffee and a full bar which nobody's at well this is my breakfast slash lunch pizza crab and shrimp with some apple juice as I'm eating this pizza they just played the Loki anthem from his Disney Plus series show as I'm staring into the ocean this is kind of crazy. It fits in a weird way. This has been the most dramatic lunch I've ever had. With this Marvel music just playing, I don't mind it. I like it. This fry will quench my hunger forever. Wow. Jit, how was your superior lunch? Phenomenal, man. <laughs> yeah. Disney has never missed 10 out of 10. Fair enough, yeah. Feeling pretty full. Excited to continue our marvelous day at sea. Uh, I see what you say. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> He's shaking his tail feathers. Yo. Yeah. At the nightclub, I'm excited for this. The Ravengers Club. We've made it to Trivia Marvel Day at Sea. This is 18 plus. It's at the bar. We got the screens at the bar. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like I might actually win. This is the only time in my life where trivia might be in my favor. We'll see. Cool thing is this pub does have food if you're hungry. And as I'm getting ready to order my drink, we have uh, Mr. Fantastic, right? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Coming to the MCU soon. I'm Dexter's I think I know the answer to this I've one. I've never read the comics, but I would assume. In the comics, Hawkeye is Yeah, I think so. What is the name of Tony Stark's business uh. partner? He's, he's the bad guy What's in the, the first movie. Yeah. That's a deep cut. Iron Fist is not featured in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but on Netflix. I think I know the answer. All of these questions are on the tip of my tongue, I swear. Daredevil, Marvel mm. Girl. Marvel Girl? <laughs> Who's that? And Iron Heart. So Not gonna lie, everyone. To you say, hey, I kind of failed. I this is what the prize looks like. Winner! Congratulations. Shang-Chi and Miss Marvel. Isn't that crazy? Oh! 
Bye, Shang Chi. <laughs> That's fun. The characters just hanging out. So I really like this. I was confused for a second what was happening, but Miss Marvel and Shang Chi were changing spots for the character meet and greets. But Captain Marvel is kind of just chilling, walking around talking to kids as they're waiting in line. It's pretty dope. I mean, like especially for the kids, that's awesome. Hey there. Hi, Captain Marvel. How are you doing? Driving. How are you? Chilling. Any missions today on the ship for you, or? Well, yes. Today we're trying to find all the missing Florkins. Oh. So you know got who's you. had babies. Yeah. Um, and we're still trying to train them all. And oh. Kamala let a few loose on the ship the other day. Oh no. Been, like eating the furniture. Uh, couches, a couple That's fair. Members. Oh no. Uh, don't worry, they're harmless. I, I know, um, they're cute. I like them. You know, Fury thinks so. After being on so many cruises over the last year, it's fun being on a Disney one because it really does feel special and different. Mainly because of the characters and the entertainment, obviously. But I think I just saw another group of people I want to say hi to, which weren't even on like the app. So. You kind of just have to walk around the cruise ship because you never know who you're going to run into. We'll be back later, all right, team. Just missed them. Had to come back up to the top deck for some sun. So this is one of the events you have to register on your phone app. We're on the Asgard side. You get to meet Loki. One thing that's significant about this event compared to other meet and greets is that they have like the camera set up and everything. So it's like professional grade photography with your characters. Oh my gosh, we have Groot and Star-Lord on the other side. Are you joking me? I want to meet them. So one thing that the cast member said is that Thor was here, but for some reason for our group, he's not, which is unfortunate. But apparently he's going to be in the show and walk around the ship, so. I feel like we picked the wrong meet and greet. See that? What? What are we doing over here, man? That's so cool. It's Groot. Yeah, he's <laughs> massive. Dude, that's nice. Hi, Groot. Look how big he is. Uh, <laughs> Hi, Loki, how you doing? I am doing most excellently as always. <laughs> Are you here to serve me in my glory? Um, you know, I kind of need help finding my glory's purpose. I know you got one. Ruin. It is to rule. Yeah. Yes, at some time and at some place. What is your glorious purpose? What should mine be? I, I know not. Hmm. What were you born to do? Entertain. There you go. Then that is your glorious purpose. To entertain the world. Wait, can I be one of your royal entertainers when that you take over the world? That was my intention. Ah, okay, cool, cool, cool. Join me in glory, and you will have a place in my royal courts. I would yes. love that. I'll oh. join your royal court. Oh, yes, you would. <laughs> That's great. Well, should we uh, take a picture to commemorate this binding contract? Absolutely. <laughs> this is my artifact of power, yeah, which allows me to tell the stories and entertain and mind control. Not as good as you, though. One day. <laughs> One can always try. Yeah. Well, good to see you, Loki. Oh, it is a pleasure. <laughs> I will see you in our glorious future. I love that. Entertain me well. I will. I will. The ocean. I love these portholes. We got Black Panther. Oh, he's getting ready and everything. <laughs> I love this. Oh, they came ready. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The line does extend out around the hallway down towards the elevators. This is going to be about 25 to 30 a minute wait. Most of these characters do roam at some point other than possibly Groot's. I think the biggest thing about the meet and greets compared to just catching them when they're walking around is getting that picture with them. Especially today, everyone's kind of dressing up. So keep that in mind. You have to actually make time for the characters because the popular ones will have a little bit of a wait. Ooh, I haven't talked about this too much. They have the Vista Cafe in the corner over here. Here's the menu. They got some specialties. Salted caramel coconut latte. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Oh! <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you so much. Anytime, I love that. Anytime. That's so fun. You know what's really cool about this is that the cup that comes with it, it's mine now. And this is only 12 bucks, which is insane. Like, what the heck? Oh, perfect espresso martini. Espresso martinis are my cruise ship drink. I don't know why. I love it though. I always have this side quest to get G to like espresso martinis. This one might be it. This one has a little bit of more espresso. No? Yeah, it's too much espresso. 
Dang. Not a coffee god. So we're about to have a costume competition. We have Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, and Black Widow kind of walking around saying hi. I want everyone to know this is our first Marvel Day at Sea. I didn't realize how like involved it was gonna be, you know? And next time, we have to bring costumes. We messed up. Yeah. Like that's half the fun. Cosplay at least. resonate with. Yeah, he's just chilling. You know, he's giving the big Lebowski vibes. One, two, three! Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. It's like both through the generations here. What multiverse do you know from, friend? These cosplays are amazing. Why aren't I wearing my jacket today? I'm such a dummy. I'm gonna go over to the Queen Mother over here. How are you doing, my dear? Wonderful. <laughs> right, and tell us what I'm sure she's straight out of Wakanda right now. I come from the multiverse of Miami, Florida. Miami, Florida. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like it's like Avengers all over again. Wait, look at Tony Stark down there. Look at that guy down there. That's sick. Right. Once again, our villains and heroes, everyone, are they fantastic? Yeah. We got the heroes of tomorrow. They're excited. Do you hear that? Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're all dressed up as Marvel heroes. That's cute. <laughs> Goofies are in there. Don't they look marvelous, everyone? Oh, thanks a lot, everybody. Oh, we sure are happy to be here. Woo! Oh, 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 <laughs> Minnie, you look amazing, Spider Gwen and Captain America's Mickey. It's good to see you guys. I love your hat. It was such a surprise. I'm I'm happy that we get to take a picture real quick. Should we take a picture? Is that okay? Okay, let's do it. I'll see you later. You look amazing. <laughs> what a surprise. Dude, who thought? We got to get and see them so quick together. I know. Meeting they're... Mickey and Minnie in their special outfits. Dude, Marvel, Mickey and Minnie? Who would have thought? <laughs> Not me. Man. Look at the line now. Yeah, the line's huge. <laughs> Jeez. That made my cruise. Like, that was, that was like the Disney magic. Well, seeing them all come out like that was insane. That was perfect. We got Chip and Dale as Loki and Thor. Absolutely lovely. Daisy and Donald look absolutely amazing. Oh my gosh, look, Donald's meeting the Hulk. <laughs> He's dressed as Hulk. Last but not least, we got Goofy and Pluto. Goofy as Iron Man and Pluto as just an Avenger, I think? He's just wearing an Avenger scarf. I love Goofy sunglasses, that's so sick. They also have a latte of legends themed around Marvel. Everybody, you need to understand that there's so much happening on this ship that we can't possibly cover everything. Jeep brought this up. They have an Avengers training initiative on the top deck. Seems like something for the family. Let's see what happens. By the way, our sponsor for this Marvel Day at Sea is By Glen Exploration Travel. Zach is a fellow YouTuber and a full service travel advisor who loves cruising and loves connecting his clients with the cruises of their dreams at no extra cost. Visit getbyzach.com today for a complimentary quotes. Honestly, I met Zach on Icon of the Seas and I'm glad to call him a friend. He's dope. Thank you, Zach. You're going to go in some buildings that require some space, so give yourself some plenty of room. We don't want you open into your neighbors. For our instructors. Right. Rule number two. Respect the equipment. Now it's this. Argonzola. He hacked the cruise ship while they were training. It's cute though, you get kids. It kind of reminds me of Jedi training in Hollywood Studios. Aim. Attack. Three, five. 
It's time for another event, but look, it's Thanos. I wish we had more of him. Maybe we'll see him tonight. I'm hoping he's like the bad guy. If we see Thanos here in person, that'd be absurd. <laughs> Always making new friends. What's up, guys? Oh, yeah. Yeah. What's up? Are you guys having fun on your Marvel Day at Sea? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. The gelato was good? Oh, yeah, you had so much of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's much. <laughs> Just to let you guys know, as you see, all the characters that we saw earlier are meeting, but now they're not together. So make sure you go to those random like flood events because it's kind of more rare to get Donald and Daisy together. Um, this may be a hot take, and no disrespect, to Disney, just me personally. On a cruise that I'm paying thousand dollars to be on. I would never wait in a line to meet a character. Wait, why? There should be like virtual keys or something. That people, could be cool. People paying a lot of money don't want to like minimize their time. It's a personal take for you. I know people who are a little bit older, 20 to like 35, 40, they might not want to meet the characters. And it's nice that they provide other things to do other than just characters. But yeah. for families, that's like a big thing, you know? So they also might not even mind because this might be like their relaxation time. True. Hey, maybe one day when you have a kid, you'll have to wait in line to meet Mickey Mouse. Yeah, maybe it'll be a nice, like, hey, the kid has to wait, the kid has to stop doing everything. This is good realization time. Yeah. But me personally, as I am right now, as a 23 year old, <laughs> not me. <laughs> Forgetting your age for a second there, huh? <laughs> we're about to watch the Star Spangled USO show. Of course, we're getting a drink as well. I love how there's so many small events happening around the ship. Like this is only happening right now, I believe. If y'all watched yesterday's video, we did a margarita tasting. So we got the same drink. Cheers, Jeet. This is a crazy vibe. I would not expect to be like transported like this. This is nice. Yeah, this is really cool. Like, it's, it's super chill. I'm enjoying this for sure. Great music, great talent. Great drinks. I was about to say, <laughs> it's good. <laughs> Nine forty-four for a margarita. Not bad at all. Always making new friends. We got Sophie Hi. and Becky. Hi. 
and they're wearing the Marvel Dead oh, see yeah. shirts. That's really cool. It's pretty marvelous. Oh. <laughs> I love that. That's a, oh, you're good. No, it's, no, it's okay. I like your shirt too. <laughs> So you guys like being on the ship? Yeah, we love it. absolutely love it. We've just both come back from vacation, so we're fresh, exactly. we're ready to go. This is literally my second day back, and to come into the world of rainbows and unicorns, that is Marvel Day at sea. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best. Lovely. One thing I didn't do, which I should have, is decorate my door. Like, they're so fun. This door has Thanos on it. Back in the room before we continue our evening activities. What is this? Gee, do you know what this is? I just read it out. What is it? It's Thor's hammer. No way! <laughs> oh my god, I did not <laughs> Wait. When we came in, I couldn't see it from that no, angle. No, I thought. This angle makes complete sense. Well, no, it's weird because perception, you're thinking it's an animal. Because yeah. every single time I've ever been on the cruise, I'm thinking. Bram, bram, bram. Uh oh. He's not. Ah! Worthy. Oh, he's worthy! I'm worthy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that is iconic. Wait. That's actually really cool. I keep saying this, but this just made the cruise. <laughs> <laughs> Fit check, uh, Mickey shirt, brown pants, and I'm wearing a Starlight jacket. I kind of wish I had this on during the day because my pictures would have been that much better. It is what it is. G, uh, he's wearing his merchandise, Memories Over Money, uh, pants, uh, Zara. Brand, $70. Brand new. On our way to our next event, we have the shield. It's actually the kids menu. Day at sea, pretty cool. Thank you. And what's your name? You do social media. Tina. Tina. <laughs> Where can we find you? Uh, Tina Sesta. There we go. <laughs> oh. And the baby sweater, it's cute. Yeah. For my adults, they do have happy hours on the ship. Tonight, it's at the Cove Bar. During happy hour, I got this beer. Six bucks. Not bad. And that includes gratuity. So this isn't the fireworks show, but they have like a show before with Mickey and Minnie. Now, let's all Mickey and Minnie Superhero Ready? Celebration. Now what do you think Dolph and the Hulk have in common? That they're angry? Angry! 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 Just like the Hulk, Dolph knows that strength can be physical, but it can also be mental too. Like knowing when not to let it all out. So we got Black Panther over there, but I noticed that we have some cast members standing around. This area is roped off. Something's about to happen. Characters are just randomly popping up. We got Kate Bishop and Hawkeye <laughs> just talking to a kid. And there's Doctor Strange. He's meeting people as well. Good to see you, Thor. Yes, nice to see you. Yeah. Yeah, I put on his jacket. Yeah. You know, I'm not gonna lie. Earlier, I told him I'd be his like grand entertainer if he rules the world. But I mean, you could join me. We could be a side act together. Why would I join you if you already joined him? Now? Oh. Because you are such a humorous actor. You do so. Well. <laughs> I don't think I'm like comedy. In there. Comedy, yeah. You're really funny. That's why. Yes. You know, I'm the funniest Avenger as well as the strongest. That's the one. Agreed. I'm Agreed. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the hell? The rifle team. The rifle team. This is crazy. Yeah. Okay. So basically, all the Avengers are just walking around at this point. See, this is what I thought this entire day was gonna be. Just meeting Avengers, being superheroes all day. Them just roaming around, walking around. Yeah. I understand why they don't have them roaming around all day because it's kind of a little bit chaotic right now, but like in a fun way. You definitely can't do this all day. How you doing? Yeah, not too bad. How are you? Good. You know, day at sea, can't complain. How was your day at sea? You know, not too bad doing some recon. Uh, yeah. Nothing out of the ordinary too much, aside from Loki, of course. Yeah, but, uh, we saw him earlier. Apparently, I'm going to be his like entertainer if he takes over the world. Interesting. What but, kind like, of skill do you have? I mean, I can make people laugh. I'm a storyteller, you know? All right. Yeah, I see you've got star Lord's jacket on. Yeah, I do. A bit like him, huh? A little bit, you, you know. You don't have a giant tree that follows you around, huh? No, I don't have a Groot, but I got the confidence. Hey, that's all that matters. <laughs> Hooked on a feeling. Look at Groot vibing. Oh my god. Holy moly. Heroes are just everywhere right now. It's crazy. I mean, if there's someone you want to meet, you might have a chance to meet them here. This is nuts. I love Groot. I want to meet Groot. I want to give him a hug. 
Smokey, Wasp is all the way at the top. This is Marvel Day at Sea. <laughs> Kamala is trying to get their attention. <laughs> I love that. Hey, it's good to see you. There's so many Avengers here. Are you, are you like freaking out or what? I'm feeling so many feelings right now. Yeah. Talk about so many fan fiction ideas. I, oh, true. Okay, okay. okay, okay. So, we got Kate Bishop and Hawkeye. Yeah, yeah. Teaming up, get this, with the Guardians. With the Guardians? That would be a crazy story. They had, they had to San Francisco. Yeah, yeah. They, they'd see a giant marshmallow that's trying to take over San Francisco, but they defeat it by the <laughs> Listen. That's great, but I got a better story. What about you and Kate Bishop forming your own Young Avengers team? Have you thought about that? Oh, uh, um, let's just say it's in progress. Okay. I've so far, I've got leads on Cassie Lang. Ooh, okay. Are any like other young heroes out that you can Ah, uh, shoot. You know, off the top of my head, no. I, I feel like there's someone. I I, I, I don't know anyone right now. Don't though. worry. I've got Monica's favorite tablet. It's got all the info on all. True. Of true. All right. Well, I look forward to see what you get done. Okay. <laughs> Should we take a picture real quick? This is crazy, dude. This is this is madness, but I love it. We got Spider-Man here as well. It is kind of chaotic here, though. I will say that was absolutely insane. Now that wasn't on the app. But basically, it was just a character free-for-all featuring Marvel personalities. It was great. I will say, though, because it's a free-for-all, that means there's no character attendance. And the characters are allowed to roam. So maybe you're waiting in line and then they go somewhere else. Or you want to see a character or they're blocked off. Regardless, I had a great time. But I want all of you guys to know at home that... A lot of families wanted to meet the characters and some of them did get a little mad because they don't understand roaming. As someone who's been to uh, Avengers Campus and other theme parks where roaming is more normal, I know that you might wait in line and then if they leave you're kind of out of line. But there was a situation where uh, Hawkeye and Kate Bishop moved to a new place right in front of me. And as I was about to meet him, a mother and her father <laughs> got extremely mad at me because like, we've been waiting since upstairs. So again, it's not my place to tell them what the rules are and maybe those aren't the rules. But like, again, I just didn't want to deal with getting into a confrontation and I just walked away. It didn't make me feel very uncomfortable. She literally said like, hey, I have children. By the end of the day, I did pay for this cruise ship as well and I would love to meet them. But, you know, I want the kids to have a good experience. So it was kind of an awkward situation where when there's no rules, that means people get upset personally. I still had a great time as you saw, but just keep that in mind that things can get a little crazy. Anyway, it's time for dinner. And we are back at the animator's palette. Now the thing about tonight is that because it's Marvel Day at Sea, the color scheme has changed, red and blue, different menu. We do get to stay at the same table, same waiters. Look at this, special edition Marvel Day at Sea menu. The menu is comic based, we have cod filet, meatballs, pasta, appetizers are based off characters, that's fun. Funny enough, Wakanda Tasting Lab, this is something that they offer on the Disney Wish during the Marvel Avengers restaurant, the testing kitchen with Ant-Man and the Wasp. A room with Grand Marnier, vodka with Midori, and gin with rosemary and thyme. We have the Wakanda tasting lab. Wakandan Piri Piri. For dinner we got pasta and meatballs. Cheesecake? Oh, you missed. It's okay. And I got like the olive cake. Yeah? We know Disney, man. They don't miss. 10 out of 10. Has a lot of flavor. It's something I normally wouldn't get, but it's delicious. Honestly, the appetizer, the entree, and the dessert, all good tonight. I give it a solid 8.5 out of 10. Whoa! Not my favorite. I know Jeet's freaking out right now, but Definitely good, especially for Marvel Day at Sea. Like, I, I would eat this again. So we got here about 20 minutes early. People are already squatting. 
are there spots. The interesting thing is that the floor is like divided. So you can't be in the center because there's a stage right there. As you see, they have tape lined up on the cruise ship, dividing everyone. It's interesting. Was not expecting this. And they have a whole like do not enter area right over here. So needless to say, with the limited amount of space, make sure you show up at least, at least 30 minutes early. A lot of the space is taken up by these big cameras. So we just found out that this is a sit down only area, which is great. I love it. Yeah, for kids and adults alike. But we're trying to figure out where we can stand as well so we can show you guys a good time. Well, they do have standing areas as well, which we decided to go for. Not too many people over here, which is better for me because I don't want to ruin anyone's show with my cameras. I just want to have a freer range of mobility when it comes to moving. But the fireworks shoot off from the right side if you're staring at the big screen. Just a few moments, beloved Wait, this is so Tony cool. Stark it says the Daily Bugle. With a special unveiling. Who's ready to see it? Yeah! Same here. And you never know who's going to show up at one of his events. Do we have any Iron Man fans out there? Yeah! What about my Spider-Man fans? Yeah! Hello there! Can you tell us your names and where you're from? I'm Dana and I'm from Kansas City. I'm Grammy Susie and I'm from Minnesota. Let's go! I'm Susie and I'm from Missouri. <laughs> yeah! I'm Amelie and I'm from Minnesota. Wonderful! I love it! Now friends, do we have any special things we'd like to talk about today? What was your favorite part about today? When I met Black Panther and Shuri. Oh, that's pretty exciting. Yeah, Did you do anything yeah, yeah. fun with them? We took some pictures and he gave me an autograph. Wow, an autograph from the king himself. Pretty exciting. <laughs> oh. It's like Tony Stark has prepared for It's Stanley. Wow. You just enjoy yourselves. Oh, and don't wow. worry about that's the thing. thing because it looks I'm going to cry. Ooh. That's crazy. Silly. Wow, the cameo. I am Friday. That's really an cool. An advanced artificial intelligence system created that's, by Tony Stark. That's special. And these events will feature technology that allows us to see into the multiverse. Now, the multiverse is a complex theory, but we have a few experts here to help explain it all. Please welcome Sorcerer Supreme Wong and his acolyte, America Chavez. Wait, I'm, where's America Chavez? Where's America? Uh, I, I want to meet America Chavez. Where's he been at? We can assure you that the multiverse is very real. It's long. Absolutely. I've been traveling between them ever since I was a little kid. Five, oh, oh. four, three, <laughs> two, one. And now, please welcome the man of the hour, an innovator ahead of his time, technological genius, and your host for tonight's thrilling event, the incomparable Tony Stark. Where is he? excited to be here. That's what I thought, because tonight is going this to is change awesome. your life. First, of course, there's me. Can't say I ever get tired of that. Next, we're going to be introducing some technology that is really going to blow your mind. And finally, I may have invited a few friends. Hey, everyone. We'll be down in a minute. Or should I say, Ant-Man? Next, we have a true patriot in our symbol of freedom, <laughs> Sam Wilson, or as we all know him, Captain America. What's up, everyone? Wow, I was kind of expecting you to show off your fancy wings, Sam. Well, I didn't want out to do your entrance, Tony. Wings in the shop, huh? <laughs> You're just mad you don't have wings. So true. All right, settle down. The ultimate multiverser. What? Using PIM technology and their knowledge of the quantum realm and my expertise of time variables and outcomes, we are now able to use the multiverser to bend time and space to experience infinite multiverses. Pretty fantastic, right? 
Yeah, none of that sounded like a good idea. He lost the voice, and nobody gets hurt. Oh. Who's gonna hurt us? You, bro? Oh, yes. You got it big time. Who are they? The Tracksuit Mafia. Kate Bishop? They're Kingpin's guns. Who are you calling goon? You're the goon, bro. Good to see you, kid. Is Hawkeye gonna join us? Oh, he said he needed some away from Tony time. Oh, you didn't tell me they multiply. Hey, Cap, you have a team up, or do you only work with Barnes? We're not exclusive. I'm coming too. Hey, the more the merrier. Sorry, everyone, we are going to have to break away from our regularly scheduled program, so keep your eyes peeled. Let's split up. Let's ride, Marie Antoinette! This is Sam Reyes, who is reporting live for the Daily Mule. And most likely, the Disney stream has been reported by a game known as the Tracksuit Mafia and a... Hey! Get off me! Go! Hey! It's the boss! Oh, whoa! Oh, 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 oh. Look at oh. Let's follow the action. <laughs> okay, I am so over this. Yeah, you tell Kingpin I'm not interested in sharing my stuff. Everyone okay? Uh, yeah. Hey, Mosquito! I brought friends this time. Ready for a rematch? You know it. my latest tech. Latest tech? That's it. Mr. Stark! What is it? I don't even have you on my schedule. Oh, yes. Sorry. That's because I'm from another multiverse. Another multiverse? Yeah. You see, this was all happening the same way in my universe. And after you introduced the ultimate multiverser... Wait, wait. The ultimate what now? Multiverser. You built it with Ant-Man and the Wasp to appear into other multiverses. Oh, yeah. You're definitely from another world, kid. So, is that the multiverser thing? Yeah. It started acting crazy after it blew up. Wait, it blew up? I kind of dropped it. Now it's zapping me in other worlds. <gasps> That's so cool! We had better get him back home. This kind of technology would be dangerous in the wrong hands. You're right! Any second now, a group called the Tracksuit Mafia is going to attack your presentation. <laughs> Morning. Several hostiles are invading the ship. Those don't look like tracksuits. Wow, that's crazy. It's a different person.
But my family still needs me. And I need them. I have to keep trying. You. You're coming with me. <laughs> you know, this really doesn't concern me anymore. Unbelievable. That was so much fun. I can't even imagine being a kid watching that. No, I, I think we're a lock on mine. I feel how happy we're sitting down. I was jumping right here. But overall, truly, that was just a really good show. I mean, seeing Black Panther good. and Shuri. Good. That was phenomenal. What did Shuri say when she saw T'Challa? She's, like, oh. She's like, oh, I've missed you. Where have you been? He was like, I never left. I've always been right here. Quit playing with that's me. that You're pulling on my heartstrings, man. Bro, it's it. We literally felt like we watched the movie plot. 
they could have made this instead of all the crap that they made over the last year so much better so much better this what that was must be what they're gonna like fully end with like when they're fully done with mcu because that was yes i i truly think um it's not infinity war secret it's a uh, secret wars i feel like if they don't use part of that kind of plot was insane because like even sam wilson and captain america yeah, meeting like each not, other yeah. and he said like and in black widow because she's gone too was like i like the new look sam right like there are so many nuances it's crazy to think that a disney cruise line show did a better job than the freaking disney plus shows and the disney movies right now is insane dude that was is am, am i wrong no Loki is the best Disney Plus show. Everything else is kind of mid. That was unbelievable. Guys, you don't understand. This is a big deal for us because we truly love Marvel. And I can confirm after today that a Marvel Day at Sea is worth it. My thing is, like, when I go to Disney, I've never had that, like, kid moment. I've never had that, like, oh, like, my jaw's on for the entire time. That's what I just had. Yeah. Like, that was, like, everything I could have ever wanted out of Disney, out of Marvel. Yeah. Today made it worth it. And we still have more to come and there will be like entertainment opportunities to meet these characters but today is the real themed day and we have one more event we need to go to and the day's not even over yet the ravagers club aka like the the, the ravagers from the guardians of the galaxy it's an 18 plus event so the fact that they even have a marvel 18 plus event late at night go to the bar grab some drinks spend your money here man if you want Spin your mind on anything Disney, this is it. This is the one. This is... Gee, I'm glad we did this, man. Yeah. I'm glad you are here with me, man. Had to be here for this one. <laughs> Had to be here for this one. Man. <laughs> if I would have saw this on your vlog, I would have been so upset. Well, the Ravages Club is a nightclub. Good to see. <laughs> So we're wrapping up in the club. Right. What's your name? Brandon. Brandon is getting married tomorrow. So Woo! make sure you subscribe Woo! because I feel like we might crash the wedding. Crash? We're okay, invited. no, we're allowed. Are we invited, invited now? Yeah. Handshake. <laughs> All right, cool. Cause it's day at sea tomorrow. Why not? It's Cosmo tomorrow. Frogs. Frogs. After the wedding, not you. You're more than welcome to come, but. <laughs> it's a 1.49 in the morning and it's time for our movie. Are we going to watch Utopia again? We kind of fell asleep. Did you, how much did you see of it? I saw a decent amount. I also realized I've never seen Utopia. Yeah. We've only got five days and they're showing movies. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you go ahead, oh. like, subscribe, share, ring that bell. Tomorrow is Cozumel, Mexico, and we may or may not be part of a wedding. They have Sword in the Stone on here. No! <laughs> Alright guys, uh, thank you for watching. Remember every day is a blessed day to be alive. And we'll see you in the next one. Good night. I'm actually happy we're ending it this time. Compared to falling asleep the other night. Room service? Apple juice. Heck yeah. <laughs>